Jesus is the power of life. The flesh was too vulnerable, very weak. This is why you see today, someone who is carrying the Bible, preaching the word of God, after preaching, you can smoke, you can fornicate, you can steal, you can do anything bad because you are carrying the word in the flesh without the power of life. What is life? Life is not the body. Life is Jesus. Even the Holy Spirit cannot operate without the name Jesus. I'll take you there. Let's go to Romans. I'm not going to carry you to the, you know, uh, he's, he was buried, he's dead. No. That was then. Now, we need to know and see the benefit of his death and his resurrection, not the history. History cannot save you from Satan. History cannot save you from ancestral. History cannot protect you from witches and wizards. Even if you quote the Bible from Genesis to Revelation, without the power of life, you are a victim. They are going to destroy you. They are going to destroy your business. They are going to destroy your children. But with Jesus inside you, you are unstoppable. You are unquestionable. They can plan. Even those who are planning evil things against us. Because of the power of life in us, in you and me. Tuchiritule ya pantanshi. Tuchiritule sela. Sesheni, sesheni, sesheni koe. Nani wala ku sesha luimbo? You want to wind back in demonstrate? Sesheni, Sesheni, Satana Vere, Werela, 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 Werela. You see? Without what? The power. It is the power to push you for. When you sing Sesheni, the Holy Ghost who put the keys in the ignition. That is your heart. Go forward. Go forward. Go forward. Go forward. Until you reach to that point where you make it. But without the power of God, when you say, in session, in session, Satana, we Let's go. Romans chapter 1, verse 16. I want to lead you in this, you know, path so that you understand that everything is centered in this name, Jesus. Whether you like it or not, there is no way you can live without Jesus in your life. Even if you are a bishop, you are a pastor like me, you are a deacon, you are an elder, whatever that you are doing in the house of God. You are a judge, you are a lawyer, you are a police officer, you are a member of parliament, you are a counselor. With Jesus inside, imagine people of God. If Jesus, the power of life is in you, because Jesus came not to destroy but to save. Meaning, even in that position where you are, as a minister, as an MP, a police officer, a judge, your judgment will be based on the truth. When I say the truth, I mean the power of life is the one to give you the insight of the case. Remember that here on earth, you can judge. There's another judgment in heaven. This is why everyone you must know the life that you are living here on earth. People can respect you here on earth. Remember, Jesus came to restore, to reconcile, so that we live according to his will and his plan, so that no one should kill. If the job that you are doing, you are killing, I pity you. If what you are doing today is killing, and Jesus came, you know, to heal, to deliver, you, you are killing. You are fighting Jesus. You can kill the flesh. Remember the one who created the flesh you are destroying is Jesus. He came specifically to restore. The world can deceive you and mislead you. But when it is time to leave this world, you lie down lifeless in that coffin alone. People can salute, they can do whatever. Are they saluting you in heaven? He came and he said, it is finished. Let's go, 16. 
Romans 1, 16. For I am not ashamed of the gospel because it is the power of God that brings salvation to everyone who believes. I am not ashamed of the gospel because it is the power of who? Of God. Don't read the Bible like in newspaper. When you are reading the Bible, you ask God to give you the insight. Sometimes you see men of God, like personally, I can quote one scripture. It doesn't mean that there are no scriptures related to that scripture. There are many. But that scripture I give you is pregnant. I can carry you with 10, 15 scriptures. You, you put them on the paper. When you go home, you not even set your eyes on that scripture. Which is pregnant with the power of life. That scripture can take you to Jesus. That scripture can defeat your enemy. That scripture can bring healing upon your life. It doesn't mean that one scripture is not enough. You want 10, 6. No, there are so many scriptures that, you know, related, we can give as a reference to the one I'm quoting. But one scripture is enough. But let me carry you. 16. For I am not ashamed of the gospel, because it is the power of God. Remember, the kingdom of God is not history. It's not record. It is power. Even the church without power is not church. It's just an organization where people are meeting. Anywhere where you are gathering in his name, his power must be present to defend his case. This is why you see even witches and wizards are part of leadership. Because the power to lead the church is not there. It is human being you are there. Jesus came to introduce the power of life to you. Because he knows that human beings cannot live without power. They are too vulnerable to the temptation of this world. Anything can mislead you. You are a pastor. Eh? You are what? A woman is possessed with marine power. You have no power to defend marine power. You, are, you know, a woman will invite you to that house. You, have no, you, are, you are a man with feelings. There is no, what? The power of life. That is Jesus in you. A woman who just said, Kalibu. Maybe when they come in, Muchisungu. You enter the house. No man of God face, let's pray. This is a woman with a, 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 a short skirt. Uh, with uh, this one. Uh, how do you call this one? Uh, uh, you are in a boat top. A short one. A what? Man of God, let's pray. Eh? You start, oh, hallelujah. This woman is on a mission. She has evil power. Quite okay, you are quoting the Bible. You can quote 15 scriptures without the power of life. The woman who invited you is loaded with what? Evil power to destroy human beings. You are praying. By the time you are opening your eyes, you discover that the, the stomach is opening. Man of God, I feel like hugging you. Oh, 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 oh. oh, yeah, oh yeah. She's, she's now depositing her power. Tell me, if you continue with your prayer. It is only Jesus who can say, no, this is nonsense. Without the power of life, that is Jesus, you will find yourself on top of that woman. Amen. It's going to be a secret. You keep on deceiving yourself and deceiving those who are blind spiritually. The kingdom of God is not, you know, history. No. The history of the Bible, yes, is there. But for you, as children of God, you need to experience the reality. God is not history. He is real. He is ever present. So there's no way we can carry him like history. Every year, 
oh friday afu lero so bamushika lero so akabuka pashani people of god for how long he died once the next thing you need to do is to experience the results of that easter he did it once the world can celebrate the history you experience the power let me finish this is a uh, 16b first to the jews then to the gentiles in the gospel of the righteousness of god revealed a righteousness that is by faith from first to last but my main point the word i'm picking is power 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 without power god is not there it is history you are talking about let's go to john 14 john 14 verse 25 all these have spoken while still with you 26 but the advocate the holy spirit whom the father will send in my name he will teach you all things and remind you of everything i have said unto you who is talking here the holy spirit cannot even operate without who the name jesus the spirit of god to move the name jesus has to be mentioned meaning jesus is the power of life jesus is what is the power of life talking about history no talabuka tal jesus takabwelele mumanda mwe bana bakwale sana futi ngefyo mulemu sendefyo you are celebrating a dead jesus he died once the holy spirit whom my father will send in my name he will teach you there is no way you can be taught by anyone if it is not the holy spirit we are talking about divine what nature that cannot be understood by human beings no you see people carrying bible when they are occupying new offices i promise i promise are they you know sticking to their promises the answer is no there's no way you can stick to that promise without the power of life it is your voice coming out the reality inside you is a weak human being you enter that office just a week you forget that you even swear with the bible you start doing things according to your own way it's just a camouflage it's like you see me wearing a combat i'm walking you say ah a soldier i am not a soldier inside i know myself i'm just wearing what a combat this is what is happening to christianity we are faking the real you know gospel by confessing what we are not carrying inside us and we are making the church to be now like any other organization the people of this world to respect the church they must see the power they must see the proof that don't say anything bad the power of god to fight on behalf of this church if it's just you know they, to say oh thou shall not touch they will touch you they will do what they will touch you hey hey you are you are saying this and that hey uh, they will touch you then the shira is ever uh, he, he has no power he's talking he's empty we, we are coming this evening we'll feed you you see we'll give you this we'll give you problem let us the church wake up and know that the kingdom of god is not for you know the history of the bible it is the power of god i've been telling you this what can destroy you is the evil power what can save your life is holy ghost power let's go to acts chapter 1 verse 8 I know that we, we, we enjoy history, but for me, uh, I know that what can take me to heaven is the power of God. 
what can take me to heaven is what? The power of God. Listen to verse 8. But you will receive power when the Holy Spirit comes on you. And you will be my witnesses in Jerusalem and in all Judea and Samaria and to the end of the earth. These are the people who are moving with Jesus every day, eating with him, chatting with him. Jesus could not allow these people to carry the, the history of the Bible to go and preach. No. He knew that this, these people cannot stand the temptation of this world. They will face, you know, wizards, witches, women, money. If you see money, you are a pastor, you are a believer, you see money. Oh, are you going to stick to your confession without the power of life? Hmm? If you see money, money is money. Without the power of life. When I said the power of life, when Jesus comes upon your life, he will bring understanding. He will do what? Bring understanding. He told them to wait. He said, wait until the spirit of God comes upon you. When you receive this, you receive power. There you can go. Samaria, Judea, Jerusalem. Even if you, you see women, you will see nothing. Even if you see money, no one can bribe you. Because you are loaded with the power of life. You like calling Bible in the flesh. John chapter 1. Eh, Nika chapter 1. Anna chapter 1. James chapter 1. Eh, chapter 1. Eh, chapter 1. What are you getting at the end of the day? One scripture for you is enough. If the spirit of God is behind you. There is no way you can tell me that if you lead, one woman was telling me that Apanim Pusha Exodus number, uh, I looked and I said, ah, where are you going? <laughs> Simple instruction from the Holy Spirit is foolishness to the carnal mind. Simple what? From the Holy Spirit is foolishness, is useless. To the carnal mind. Because you don't know that that word is pregnant. This is what makes Naaman to, you know, to become angry. He said, they owe me a commander. You are telling me to go and dip myself seven times in that dead water. Ah, they owe me. Instead of you coming out and you put your hands on me. So that you can call your God in heaven, you heal me. The man of God, because he was under the instruction of the Holy Spirit, he doesn't look at your title, the position where you're coming from. He said, the one I am carrying is greater than your position. Go and dip yourself seven times there. Ari ai tumpika. The whole commandant, doing one, two, three, four, seven, replos gone. The man came back and said, ah, this is a man of God. If you look at the instruction from the Holy Spirit, it's useless. It's nonsense to the carnal mind. People of God, if you don't know this, you better know now. The strength of the church or a believer is not the number of people like thousands here. No. You are not my strength. I am not your strength. My strength is the power of life. That is Jesus. Remember I say that the advocate whom my father will send in my name, the Holy Spirit, will teach you everything. Jesus talking to his disciples. Again, he told them to wait. He said, wait. Until you receive what? Power. Hmm? <laughs> Come. Who is the single here? Come. Uh -huh. He stand there. This one, let me, let me show you. I'll still go back to the Bible. This one is a child of God, carrying the life of what? Power. And this one is a, is a member of the church without what? Jesus. 
This one too is a, a child of God carrying Jesus inside. This one is not carrying anything. He, he goes to church, very committed. He enjoys, you know, dancing. Yeah. He enjoy what? They are both preaching what? The word of God. I said this one has uh, come here, my daughter. Okay, this one is preaching the word without the Holy Ghost. And this one is a Christian without what? If this sister is carrying the evil power, and this one is carrying the Bible without Jesus, are you telling me that this one who, who meet this sister and continue preaching the word? He will be flexible now. You uh -huh. You face this one. Come, my, my daughter, come. Uh -huh. uh, you stand there. So, I'm going to say, 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 I'm Who is quite the Holy Ghost? Okay. Now, who is Okay. I didn't the, the, What I want to, you know, show the congregation is that you, you can deliver this sister because you are carrying the Holy Ghost. Whatever she will try to do, you know, you will say, my sister, Jesus loves you. The way, you know, you'll be talking to the sister, the power of God will leave your body and enter what? The sister. The same thing will happen to this one. He will start advancing towards the sister. The sister will say, my brother, Jesus loves you. She's not talking from nowhere. It is the spirit of God inside her, which will make now this spirit of lust in this body to be arrested. Are you, are you getting me? To be what? At the end of the day, these four will become what? Children of God. If this is why you find that even within the church, there are people who are misbehaving because they are not carrying the power of life to control their feelings. This is what we are lacking. Tell me, you are working with 500 people. Among them, there are women who are not married. There are men who are not married. And you are a, you are a man, you are a woman. Without the Holy Spirit, the Holy Spirit, the power of life. Ah, you know what I'm talking about. Uh, go and sit down. I hope you understand this. Okay, uh, go and sit down. Let's go to First Corinthians chapter 1, verse 18. This is verse 18. For the message of the cross is foolishness to those who are perishing. But to us who are being saved, it is the power of God. The message of the cross is foolishness to those who are perishing. But to us who are being saved, it is the power of what? God. Why do you want to worship God without his power in you? Are you strong enough to defeat the weakness of this flesh? Remember that Judah was among the 12 disciples. The man became weak because of what? The love of money. Then Satan captured his mind. He was there working, moving with uh, Jesus. He became the treasure. No one appointed him. I don't know what happened. He imposed himself to be the treasurer. Even at the time, you know where that woman was anointing Jesus, Judah complained to say, this a perfume is very expensive. No. Jesus introduced him to that ministry. And instead of him, you know, loving Jesus, obeying Jesus, they are, the devil captured him. Because by then, Jesus was the power of life in the physical body, present among them. But when he departed, he said, don't even go out. 
to go and preach. It is dangerous. Wait for the power of God. When this power comes upon you, you can go and preach everywhere. Children of God, listen to this. The message of the cross is foolishness to those who are perishing. But to us who are being saved, it is the power of God. It is what? The power of God. How can you say you are a child of God, you have never heard not even one day the voice of God in you? How can you say you are a minister of God? Even your dreams, you cannot understand them. You don't even know what is happening to your life. You are busy celebrating the history. I am not condemning anyone. I'm just reminding you that celebrating the history is not the way to worship God. God is real. It's not the history. Kuri baliaba pusuka infa ya kuwa yesu pa musalaba bunonshi. But baliaba lea mkua naika buwele wele. This is why kuwa liba mano ya pachalo kuwa wana mano ya kuwa mpashu wa mushiro. Awe ndela kumano ya kuwa mpashu wa mushiro eva ishu wa mpiliburo buwa laifi. Awe ndela kumano ya pano pachalo tawa ishu wa mpiliburo buwa laifi. Ba ishu wa ati laifi rupia. Life kuria, life kufuala, life kwensha, life kukula. Ni wangawa kuriri ya maya ndapari lelo avatawaripo. One day, we are going to leave this world. Whether young or old. Remember this. You better know the life that you are living now. Are you living with under the leadership of the Holy Ghost? Are you carrying the power of life? Remember what I said yesterday. He was the word at the beginning. He was with God. He was God. And God created everything through him. He became the flesh. To give life to the flesh. After creating you, you rebelled against him. Because there was no support at all. You were just, you know, living by the written document. Which you cannot obey. That is Ten Commandments. You cannot obey the Ten Commandments. It was there. You cannot obey because it was outside your body. And the body was weak. You cannot resist any temptation. The Spirit of God was not speaking to any of you. Only the record. Depending on the record. Then Jesus came. And he appeared here on earth like a human being. But he was a spirit being. So that he can give life to the weak body. Once Jesus comes upon your life, understanding is there. Wisdom from above is there. Knowledge from above is there. The way you see life is not the way they see life. Remember, by the grace and the mercy of God, Jesus appeared here on earth. He did not condemn any of the human being. No. Anyone, whether you are a wizard, you are what? As long as you accept him, you believe in him, that's the end of your problem. Your past is buried. You carry the life of power. That is Jesus in you. If you have a life of family, you have a life of family. If you have a life of family, you have a life of family. If you have a life of family, you have a life of family. You have a life of family. By the power of life. You need to eat your money because you suffered for that money. You sweated for that money. It is the ancestral that caused all these problems. But the power of life is here now to say, my son, my daughter, forget about what you know you did in the past. Here is the beginning of life. I have come with a new body. Remove that your old body. Wear my body now so that you can start a new what? A new life. Maybe you don't know this. The reason why he appeared in the flesh like a human being is to change your body. To give you his own body. And he collects the wicked body that you carry. Which is carrying in Sunko, Kaponda, Balani, Kachasu, Ifishimba, 
ubufi bantu bambi ubufi na ino shitata baleka kumuntu taba be pa ubufi mwe bana bakwalesa ke makasanga pali ba malaika le be pa in heaven there's nothing like that when satan rebelled against god the sweat was collected from him he has no sweat michael mm. chest this one he became what the only thing satan can do to you because he's a spirit being is to manipulate the flesh because he's in the spirit he has no power he has no sweat the sweat was collected from him as a child of god now jesus said muri imwe ah you need to be sensitive you need to be sensitive you need to be sensitive the power of life is the only way to survive here on earth if our leaders who are occupying offices all over the world they are carrying the power of life muchalonga tamwaba ne nkondo muchalonga tamwaba ne fia kuipana ngatamwaba no kupatana because yesu ngalela nda muri uyu na muri uyu yalalanda yesu ngaelela muri uyu na muri uyu yalaelela but because there is a standard of this world the knowledge of this world this is why satan is using that standard now to manipulate the whole thing today you are not going to celebrate history as history you need to carry the power the church was empowered through easter the resurrection power showed you that he defeated satan and his demons and he said it is finished it is what finished. this sign shall follow those who believe in my name which name the name jesus nangukupwa nangukupa umuntu fyo uri onse afiri ya upwa peacefully nanguni nchito fure for waisanga nanguni promotion nomba shino nchi kwatiyo nalili pira 10 pin nalili pira nchi nali eh bambi nokupa kuingira nchito kuyalala na balengishe nchito mwe bana bakwalesa wabwelela na kunga ndowe baba nami ati ninjingira nchito mm awe he died once he died and he said it is finished bwana mukupela obunte kumbya tiyo ninjingire nchito after bakubomfia nangu walipire ndalama today you are saying jesus namfuila nde celebrate you continue with that life no no and god's time is always what the best each and each and whether walimpata nangu walintemwa amaka ya kwalesa ya lintemwa wena ulenkani na nanguta ulenkani na amaka ya kwalesa ya lensuminisha there is no need for you to do and the one who created you he knows your needs the thing is enshrined in the heavenly constitution that mulenga you be this you may not know just fat you be this people will see you as a useless person but the power of life is in you pushing you forward pushing you forward because it is already enshrined in the heaven constitution that just what will be this people will say whatever they will say at the end of the day you are there standing there ah but just what yes because that is my destiny when the power of life is in you there's nothing that can stop you there's nothing that can limit you Nangwa balo shivenge maba Jesus wa mwimi ne banga Because if in them yeba ndeme bati Jesus ngai kala muri imwe kuti ba mimi na abantu ngafira ba mwimi ne bati tabaka kwanishe Nangu mulenda panono panono chinga cha kwati mulea mukufika kuria Mulea mukuchita shanya Panono panono tapali okwale ya ndesela Tapali okwale ya ndesela Tapali okwale ya ndesela Tapali okwale ya ndesela Tapari okwa lea ndesela. Anti una itashani. Nafuma. Nefin fiambo kutashani. Fiambo kuchitika. Because what is causing all these problems is evil power. You without the power of life, you cannot defeat evil power. You are a human being. You are too weak. Abasa mjari bebe la timuikale. Ali shibati kuri ama urioku. Yule li ali shupo kupiribula. I'm telling you. 
without Holy Ghost. Ukasanga prayer part na wewe ule. Ikale ni panchari shwa tukuli fin to finger. Nangu finger. Number one, ubulale lale. Ulupia, ne chilumba. So ikale ni. Mwipanga na mistake, muka lolele fe. Badi kele panche nde inga. Anti wa maka ya kualesa ya haba ponena. Ya ipa ya mafirings ya kuisa kumuviri. Elo ba ima bambo kuya nomba. Don't celebrate history. Experience the power. Experience what? When the power of God comes upon your life, you understand this life. You know that you can do anything and no one can stop you. Nendo shukumo ifresha ishwati na kuchitika fimo. Ifresha ambo kushwata. Ngawai mwana paku miposha. Na mumu nete tuwa mshu. Mwanisha ni mkwai. Ngoi mwuchi nshu wafuma kuisa. The power of life is in me. If you want to save Jesus with the history, I'm sorry. The power of life is at work. The one who created you is in control. But the way you worship history is what made your enemy to be more powerful than you. Immediately, one book ping gets me party in a new shrapping lesa. Immediately, one book don't talk and yama plans have be party in a new shrapping don't talk and shalesa. The Bible says, Touch not my anointed one, do no harm to my prophet. When you are thinking like that, Jehovah God to rise. He will start now advancing towards you to destroy your charms because I am carrying the power of life. That is Easter. That is Easter. Sometimes in the morning, we think I'm an enemy. What can stop your enemy? It's not because you have got money. It's not because of the position that you occupy or the title. It is the power of life. When I said the power of life, there is no way you can make it here on earth without Jesus making things happen. If in tu fuma mumpash, elo fi aisa moni kila kuisa kumuviri. Ngacha kwa tu mumpash tapa di filai chitika na mumuviri tapa kabefika chachani. May the power of life rest upon your life in the name of Jesus. The power of life. I say the power of life. Rest upon your life. The power of life. The power of life. Rest upon your life.